Hello guys, today I will explain you three topics. First is block user by IP. Second one is how can I redirect one page to another page and prevent hot linking with .htaccess. So my first topic is block user by IP. So now I will creating .htaccess file with block IP code. So here is the first tag is required all and oh and close the tag required all now i will write the code for order allow and deny this code is purpose for who is allowed from ip and who is for no after that you have to mention the your deny from and your ip address so what i do i can check my ip address right now online with my ip and this is this is guys my IP. I just copy that IP address and paste it my .htaccess file. So it's block that IP and now allow from all. This code for you. This code is what do this code? This code is allow all IP, but my IP is not allowed for this folder. So simply I just create dot ht access file with this code this is the simple code now my dot ht access file is ready now i will show you how to run that folder and it's not working on my ip now simply i run my folder so you can see that it's allowed from my ip or not so my folder name is block ip as you can see that there is the server error that means my folder is not allowing from this IP because I will put my that IP address into .htaccess file. Now I will show you if I remove that code, if I remove that code then my folder is access. So I will create one file and simply index.php and I will run that file into my URL and I then remove my code this is as for comment purpose in .stxs so I will comment my old code and now you can see that my folder is running in my so you can see that my folder is not accessed right now now I will show you I will remove my code from my .htaccess and my index.php is working here without block IP address as you can see. Hello so I will explain your second video. second topic is how can I redirect one page to another page. So you also do it from your old domain to new domain. So I will create a .htaccess file. Here is my code for from old old domain to new domain. Now you have to simply write code for rewrite engine on. After you have to put rewrite base and rewrite tool is for dot star. And after that you have to redirect for any website you want. After rewrite root dot star, you have to just simply type URL HTTP slash slash example dot com. I have for simply type my website URL web three tutor dot com. So now I will show you. I will run my folder name block IP and it's directly redirect to my website. Press enter and it's redirect to my website web3tutor.com this is a simple code for redirect one domain old domain to another new domain now guys i will explain you prevent hot linking with .htaccess file so this is our third topic here so i will write the code for that so you also write down code for rewrite engine on sam as it is on covered in topic 2 after you have to write rewrite condition for percentage http refer http refer for the site that uh, hypertext transfer protocol that's already mentioned in uh, your url by default so you have to write http after 
www that's already by default so you just uh, change in localhost right now it's highlighter here you also write down any website name here so if you have your domain www.example.com your etc name so you have to write down here so right now I'm my folder in localhost so I will write down for localhost now you permission of that uh, file to rewrite condition http refer dot star dollar for all the type file types that's run there and after you have to mention rewrite rule slash dot and in curly braces you have to type g i have already type gif and jpg so when i run jpg image then it's not displaying your folder you you also write down javascript file with extension dot js if you have html file with uh, you have to not permit the html file then you have to write dot html also now i will show you i have already one image in my folder with jpg extension here is my image name rose and his extension is jpg then i will run into my folder so i remove jpg from dot htaccess rules now it's give the permission when i run it's display look at that so it's display here you have to write full uh, image full path here now i will add g jpg extension file type and now i again run my code and you can see that is not access to the image because i will mention that in the dot ht access file with dot jpg extension you simply you have to, to mention your extension you want to permit from your folder so thank you for watching my video and also visit my website for full code a web3 tutor.com in more and youtube and there is the all the video with code i will upload it thank you for watching my video and subscribe my channel web3tutor.com on youtube